My name is Stephen Lockwood. I'm um, co-founder of Water Street Studios and the gallery director here. And I have a studio here at number two. And um, my background is sculpture. And I have a major from um, in sculpture from Northern. And graduated a few, quite a few years ago. So this piece here is a commission I'm working with with Leo Burnett through ComEd. Um, ComEd is doing a recycling refrigerator program. And they're gonna have artists um, fabricate um, the fridge is to be a sculpture working with um, pieces of the fridge or the fridge entirely of itself. Um, this will be on Michigan Avenue. So uh, inside this fridge I have metal braces in here already and I have this plexi that I've cut out that I'll put inside here. I'll have holes in the plexi for rainwater to go through because I'll have dirt and plants in here and on the outside I have the steel beams that I'm going to have look like city buildings. So I'll have the dirt and plants inside here and when I have the holes in the plexiglass, rainwater will go through and um, water um, the plants. Um, the buildings I wanted just rusting and deteriorating, um, but I got different size um, metal where some is a square and some are rectangles and I'll just um, rearrange them as I go around on the outside and weld it together. So I want to weld this on strong enough because this is a really tall beam in case anyone is going to be climbing onto it. I'm sure they're going to hold on to this. And in here for the paper um, will be the paper dispenser. So um, they can put their fingers in here, pull the paper out, and I'll have a plexiglass sheet over it so the rain doesn't get inside there and I'd have moist paper. But I'll have paper going all the way up to the top of the tube. So when they pull paper out, gravity just like slides um, more paper down. And in this paper, there's seeds that are embedded in here. So as you write your ideas, um, you slide it through the plexiglass and it'll go into the dirt. And when rainwater hits it, it'll dissolve all the paper and it'll grow your green ideas from the seeds. And hopefully it'll even overgrow onto the the rusted city that is deteriorating on the outside. In the past couple days I've um, cut out metal squares uh, and placing them as tops because before it was just metal tubing and I welded the edges onto the tubing and uh, I grinded it down so it'd be smooth as if it looked all together as if it came together like that. Alright so right here I'm gonna um, put some of the water and the salt that I have mixed in the water on the top of it because it'll rust it uh, a lot faster. All right, so what I'm doing here is welding nuts on the bottom of the bracket which will hold up the plexi. So then I'd be able to screw uh, a bolt through to hold the plexi down. So beam right here and another beam right here. And I'm able to, to drill through, and this is nice and snug. So. I have a few different plants that already started growing. I can see the little spuds. Um, these are sweet potato plants and that I just have growing so people get the idea. And I put cucumbers in there, um, stuff that are really hardy. 